I tell people my sister moved out west. You're a science teacher. Your husband, he renovates houses. You're thinking about moving, but you're gonna wait until the interest rates go down. That's not my story. <laughs> Before I was an Avenger, I made mistakes. And a lot of enemies. He's called Science Taskmaster. He controls the Red Room. They're manipulated. Fully conscious, but no choices. I should have come back for you. How many others are there? Enough. We have to go back to where it all started. So they never do that to anyone again. We're a family. We fight with you. You won't win. I've always found it best. Not to look into the past. Okay, you got a plan or shall I just stay dug and cover? My plan was to drive us away. Well, your plan sucks. At some point, we all have to choose between what the world wants you to be and who you are. I made my choice. I'm done running. Here's what's gonna happen. Natasha, don't slouch. I'm not slouching. You're going to get a big hunch. Mm, listen to your mother. Oh my God, this up, up, is... All right, enough, all of you. I didn't say anything. That's not fair. Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we will be looking at recent Black Widow news and the movie's final trailer. Remember to be sure to subscribe before you watch the video. Like, comment, and share this video too. Stick around to the end of the video for more on recent developments with the Black Widow movie. Before we get into the video, for those of you that love Marvel content, check out our Marvel playlist. We will leave a link below and in the cards above. A warm welcome to our existing subscribers. If you are new here, welcome! We make videos about the Marvel Cinematic Universe, the DC Cinematic Universe, and Funko Pops. Let's get started. Marvel Studios dropped its final trailer last Monday ahead of Black Widow's May the 1st release date, which may now be subject to change due to the studios delaying movie releases due to the coronavirus disease COVID-19. The new trailer focuses heavily on the bond between Scarlett Johansson's Natasha Romanoff and Florence Pugh's Yelena Belova. The trailer starts off in Norway with Florence Pugh's Yelena Belova. We've seen the two women fight in a previous trailer, but this is a more intimate look at their relationship and bond. Like Romanoff, Belova was a fellow recruit for the Black Widow program. Black Widow's new trailer, which is 2 minutes and 24 seconds long, is the most in-depth look at the film we've seen yet. And I've got to say, it's got us pumped. The new trailer also features more of the movie's villain, the Taskmaster, who has the ability to learn and mimic the fighting style of anyone he faces. In the first trailer, we see him take aim with a bow and arrow, which means he must have gone up against Clint Barton, aka Hawkeye. But in the new trailer, we see other Avengers mimicked by the Taskmaster. At the 1 minute 12 mark, we see Taskmaster give the Wakanda Forever salute, prompting fans to wonder if there will be an appearance by Black Panther. Like any good trailer, it ends with a quirky family scene between Romanoff, Yelena Belova, Milena Vostikov, and the Red Guardian. The studio has so far declined to shift the worldwide first May release for Black Widow, but its postponement is anticipated in the wake of the studios announcing that both its live-action remake of Mulan and The New Mutants will be delayed by the coronavirus pandemic. What do you think of the trailer? Are you looking forward to Black Widow? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. We upload videos every Monday and periodically throughout the week. Remember to like, comment, share this video. It really helps the channel, which in turn helps us to make more content for you to enjoy.
Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to never miss a video. Check out our Black Widow playlist for more news from the Black Widow movie. Breaking news! The release date for Black Widow has been officially delayed amid the coronavirus pandemic, Variety reported earlier today. A new date has not been set yet. The move comes after AMC Theatres announced Monday that all of its theatres across the country would be closed for 6 to 12 weeks after the CDC recently suggested limiting public gatherings to no larger than 10 people. Regal Cinemas also decided to shut down all their locations until further notice, leaving Disney no choice but to postpone Black Widow's release. We will let you know any further developments as they happen. In the meantime, for up-to-date information on the Black Widow movie, check out our Black Widow playlist. We will leave a link in the video description and in the cards above. Oh,